guys welcome back to my youtube channel hope you guys are doing great in today's video i'll be talking about the routine vaccination schedule in cameroon for children from 0 to 24 months old this routine vaccination schedule is being encouraged by the expanded program on immunization also known as the epi whose aim is to control prevent and eliminate vaccine preventable diseases before we move to this routine vaccination schedule in Cameroon, I just want to say that if you are coming into my YouTube channel for the very first time, please subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any of my upcoming videos. And it's very important for you to know that the goal of vaccination is to promote individual and community health. So this routine vaccination schedule for children from 0 to 24 months in Cameroon is very important so this routine vaccination schedule in cameroon has been divided into six contacts the first contact is at birth that's after delivery the baby has three vaccines that needs to be administered that will prevent against three contagious diseases the first vaccine that will be administered to your baby after birth is bcg BCG is also known as Bacilli Carmet Grain. The aim of this vaccine is to prevent against tuberculosis. Tuberculosis is a contagious form of disease that can be transmitted through coughing and sneezing. And the second vaccine that will be administered to your baby is Oral Polio Vaccine Zero. It's also known as OPV Zero. This vaccine is to prevent against poliomyelitis. Poliomyelitis is a highly contagious form of disease that affects the nervous system and can cause severe forms of paralysis within us. So this OPV vaccine is very important. And the third vaccine that will be administered to your baby after birth is Hepatitis B0. This vaccine is to prevent viral Hepatitis B. Viral Hepatitis B is an infectious disease that can be transmitted through infected body fluids, blood and unprotected sexual intercourse. A mother can also transmit it to the baby if proper vaccination isn't followed up. So these are the vaccines that your baby needs to receive immediately after birth. And the second contact of this vaccination will occur when your baby is six weeks old and during this contact four vaccines will be administered to the baby the first vaccine that will be administered to the baby is penta 1 this penta 1 is to prevent against five diseases and these diseases are diphtheria whooping cough viral hepatitis b hemophilus influenza type b and tetanus this vaccine is to prevent against these contagious diseases. Yeah, these are all very contagious diseases except tetanus, which can be gotten through the, un the use of unsterilized equipment during the delivery of a woman. No, most women tend to give birth at home before reaching the health facility. So those equipments that might, be, might have been used at home to cut the umbilical cord may not be that sterile. So this may put the baby and the mother at the risk of having titanus. And titanus can be very deadly for both the mother and the baby, especially if they have not been vaccinated. The second vaccine that we administered at six weeks is Nemo 13 one This vaccine is to prevent against pneumococca infections. These are infections like pneumonia. And the third vaccine that we administered at six weeks is oral polio vaccine one, also known as OPV one. This vaccine is to prevent against poliomyelitis. And the fourth vaccine that will be administered to your baby is rota one. This rota one is to prevent severe forms of diarrhea that are being caused by the rota virus. So these are the vaccines and we are, will be administered at the second contact of this routine vaccination in Cameroon. Now moving on to the third contact of this routine vaccination, it will occur when the baby is 10 weeks old. 
and during this contact, four vaccines will be administered to the baby. And the first vaccine that will be administered to the baby during this contact is Pentad 2, Rotat 2, Nemo 13 2, and OPV 2. All these vaccines are given to prevent the diseases that were mentioned in the second contact of this routine vaccination. Now let's move on to the fourth contact. The fourth contact of this routine vaccination in Cameroon normally occurs when the baby is 14 weeks old. And during this 14 weeks old, the baby will be administered four vaccines. And the first vaccine that will be administered to the baby is inactivated polio vaccine, which is also known as IPV. This is the injectable form of the oral polio vaccine. And the second vaccine that will be administered is oral polio vaccine 3. And the third vaccine is Nemo 13 3. And the fifth vaccine, the fourth vaccine rather, is Penta 3. All these vaccines are being administered to prevent the various diseases that were mentioned in contact 3. Now let's head on to the fifth contact which will occur when the baby is within the ages of 6 to 11 months. So during the fifth contact, at 6 and 11 months, the baby will, will, take, the baby will take the vaccine vitamin A. And this vitamin A is to prevent the baby from being deficient in vitamin A. Because a deficiency in vitamin A can cause blindness in your baby. So this vaccine will be administered to the baby at 6 months and at 11 months. And at 9 months, the baby will receive the yellow fever and the measles vaccine. These vaccines will be administered at 9 months of age. And let's move on to the sick contact. The sick contact of this routine vaccination in Cameroon will occur when the baby is within 15 to 24 months old. And during this fit contact, three vaccines will be administered to the baby. The vaccines are the measles vaccine, the rubella vaccine, and the meningitis vaccine. So these are the vaccines that will be administered to the baby from 0 to 24 months old. So guys, we have come to the end of this episode for the routine vaccination schedule in Cameroon for children from 0 to 24 months old. If this video was helpful, please comment below and tell me what you think. And don't forget to like my video, subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any of my upcoming videos. I'll see you all in my next video. Thank you for watching. Thank <laughs> you.